Chris Crux, that's her. <laughs> but you're here to talk about Franklin. What's it doing? <laughs> I'll talk about Franklin. If I could donate cooler temperatures, I promise I <laughs> we'll would. We'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> Here's what's going on. Hurricane Franklin this evening. Our first hurricane of the 2017 season. Normally, we see our first hurricane on average, I should say, about August 10th. So we're just about there. We just had a bunch of short-lived, weak tropical storms before that. That got us to F pretty quickly. 75 mile an hour winds moving to the west at 12. Uh, less than 12 hours or so uh, from landfall, and the future track shows the storm making landfall tonight and then weakening quickly over the mountains of Mexico. So, a wind event near the coast and then a flood event over the mountains. Here's uh, what else is going on. There is Franklin way over there. Here is a upper level low combined with the tropical wave. Both those features are moving our way, so our rain chances go up. We'll see a good chance for showers and thunderstorms starting tonight and continuing through Saturday. And then this next feature out here. Here's an upper low as well and a tropical disturbance. The upper low actually helping to limit the development with that tropical disturbance, but certainly we'll watch it. Overall medium development potential most likely would occur somewhere out in this general area. And right now it looks like it should stay to the east of South Florida. In terms of closer to home, we're looking at the moisture from that wave over the Bahamas. Showers and thunderstorms covering much of the northwest Bahamas. Activity gradually working its way toward us. So we'll see showers and thunderstorms a little bit later tonight and most likely tomorrow through Friday. Keys camera this afternoon. Beautiful afternoon. It's been beautiful everywhere. Lots of blue out there. A gentle breeze. Summer warm temperatures. 90 in Miami, 87 Fort Lauderdale, Hollywood, 89 in Key West. 7 on the stick of the scale feels like 98. East wind at 15, gusting up to 23. Here are the computer models tracking all the blobs of moisture. There's the Franklin moisture down there in the western and southwest Gulf. We've got the moisture from the tropical wave moving in, so there are rain chances up for Thursday and then into Friday and then even into Saturday. And then finally it moves out. There's that disturbance in the Atlantic showing up in the models coming up there and then starting to move on to the north. And we're still in the edge of moisture. So good chance for showers and thunderstorms the next few days before things start to improve. Temperatures across the country, they're warm through Texas, but everybody else enjoying a pretty nice August day. Temperatures mostly in the 70s and 80s, even 60s in the upper Midwest. Pattern favors more cold fronts coming down. Temperatures are going to be comfortable through much of the month of August. Here's our forecast for tonight. Not here, though. It's going to be warm and humid here. Spotty storms moving in later on tonight. Warm and humid, alone near 80 degrees. Tomorrow, look for passing storms, downpours in spots. High temperature right around 90 degrees. For boaters, winds are coming up just a little tiny bit. Southeast at 10 to 15 seas around 2 to 3 feet of light chop on the base. Taking us through the weekend. Passing storms tomorrow, passing storms Friday. Still some storms around Saturday. I think Sunday will be the drier of the the weekend days. Elliot. All right, Craig, thanks a lot.